Luke chapter 2, verse 8 says this. And there were shepherds living out in the fields nearby, keeping watch over their flocks at night. An angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were terrified. But the angel said to them, Do not be afraid. I bring you good news of great joy that will be for all the people. Today in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is Christ the Lord. This will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in cloths and lying in a manger. The shepherds being in the manger scene. Kind of interesting. The shepherds were the lowest of the low. They couldn't even open a bank account. It kind of has this huge contrast between the shepherds and the wise men, kind of showing that everyone's there. But that's not really the message of the shepherds. The shepherds understood the moment more than anyone else. When you think about the shepherds, they were listening to this story, a baby, a new baby's being born. Well, that's not all that exciting unless it's your baby. That's the only time you're really excited about a baby being born or a grandbaby. It's in a, a, a manger. Okay, that's different, but still looks kind of like a crib. But what they understood was the language being used was the same language that they used for lambs that were set aside, who were perfect, that would be brought to the temple and sacrificed for the sins. And when they would wrap those lambs up, it was so that it wouldn't bump into anything, get scars on them, be damaged in any way. They were wrapped up in the same language, the cloth. The same language was that, this, that they were going to be protected so that they could go perfect to sacrifice for the sins that we have committed. And when they hear that language, they understood the moment. They understood that this baby was different that this baby was going to represent all of us and all of our sins. And what do they do when they understand the moment? They drop everything and they go to see this king. For us, do we understand the moment? When you look at the manger and you see the shepherd, it should always make us step back and say, do I understand the moment. I get so distracted by the shiny objects of life. I get so distracted by so many things. Do I understand that it's all about Jesus? It's all about right now and his purpose in my life as I move forward. Am I letting everything else in the world distract me from what matters most? Understand the moment. And like the shepherds, give love. 